Korea is 3-1 up. And we're going to play and see the final men's singles, men's singles number three, Ha Yong Wong of Korea against Chong Nam of Thailand. His opponent, Panawit Tung Nguam of Thailand. And the match on the adjacent court here. You can just see the Russian player. Denmark is 3 1 up in the tie against Russia in the Uber Cup. And we are here ready for the coin toss. As you can see, the head to head, Ha Yung Wong leads 1 0. So it's interesting to see that uh, here we have Ha Yong Wong. His height is 188, one of the taller players. His ranking is 214, and the highest he's been is 117. And his opponent here, Tung Nguam. And we Tung Nguam, 22 years of age, 178. And his ranking is 54, and the highest is 49, and that was on the 3rd of May, 2018. He has only been number 49 in the world, just one week. But nevertheless, once again, it's a sign of the very nice work done here in Thailand with all the junior badminton they're having lots and lots of good players coming through to the international circuit and here we have uh, Joanne Leong of Hong Kong our umpire ready to play and our service judge is Jitin Bat of Australia Ladies and gentlemen, on my 
right, Korea, represented by Ha Yong Hoon. And on my left, Thailand, represented by Panawit Tong Nam. Thailand to serve, Lavo play. Oh, that's a nice disguise play by her. One, oh. That cross court was really neatly played. Yeah, good attack here Three, by Jung Nam. Very agile player, 178 height and makes him good height for Babinson, good reach, but still very quick on his feet. The 10 centimeter taller Ah from Korea is having a good reach, but not as quick on his feet as his opponent. Yeah, good follow up here. And 4 2 to Tung Nam. Good variation of that uh, low surf from Ha when he was serving wide, and thereby mixing up his options. Yeah, good play. International Challenge last year in 2017 and became runners up in Mexico in 2015. I must say, last, last time I, I saw Panovic, I saw him play in the Malaysian Masters in uh, 2017 where he actually collapsed on court and fainted and was rushed to hospital, but obviously. Luckily, everything was good, no problems. But it was quite strange and, and weird to see him just completely collapse on court and we had to carry him out. Over. So, good to see Six, him here today, five. all fit and well. When it comes to Ha Yong Wong, he um, played the China Masters this year where he lost to Su Siji of China. 21-16, and also this year in Osaka Seven, International Challenge, five. he took uh, Taku, Takuma Ueda from Japan to three games, and Ueda is a good player on the international circuit. He uh, 
won the first game 21-16, then he lost 21-18 and 21-19. So that was a very close match in three games. So it doesn't really justify his ranking. Service over. Six, seven. Finish here. Service over. Uh, Jung Nguyen. Eight all. Follow up there. Uh, Jung Nguyen. Very nice play. Cross court drop shot there. Again, the umpire is rushing the players, making sure that we have continuous play. Ten, eight. So it's always easy to sit here Nine, in hindsight. Ten. But it, it was a surprise to me somehow that uh, Tanung Sak, Kirsten Sung Bun Suk from Thailand in the, in the men's singles was not selected. And obviously it was also a surprise to me that Isara Bodin was not selected for the uh, men's doubles. And especially now when you oh. consider that uh, Thailand has lost two men's doubles in this tie against Korea. Maybe a, a player of standard of Isara Bodin could have made a, 11, 10, a in the difference in this, uh, in this match. So the confirmation here, 11-10 for Tung Nam. ครับพอคุณไม่ใช่แบบคุณไม่ใช่เหมือนกันคุณโค้ชตัดสินบอลจนคุณไม่ใช่คุณเตะดิ Eleven ten. Play. Yeah, that's well left. But coming back to what I was trying 12, to say before the 10. interval as well is that, of course, uh, of course it. Uh, the part Ten. did not play this match which was um, either it's a tactical move he was the uh, is the um, 
best men's singles player from um, from Thailand on the world ranking at the moment. I'm not playing this match, so one can speculate 14, that maybe he's injured. 10. Um, but that would also have put a, a little bit more depth into this Thailand team in the in the men's singles. So. Um, You can say Thailand is playing a, a young team, a very uh, young team indeed, in, in the fact that they have an average age 15, of 22.7. But uh, I'm sure they would also like to go through to the quarterfinal stages by using some of the more experienced players. So uh, it's always a, a very fine line between the two things. Service over. 11. 15. So head coach Rexy Meineke from Indonesia have been uh, head coach here in, in Thailand for the past two years and his contract is up at the end of the year 2018. Yeah, that was a bit of overcommitment there. Moved into the 12, net too early. 15. Was sure that uh, Ha was playing to the net. However, he chose to play to the uh, back line and he completely missed that one. So 12-15 it is. Going back to my previous point as well, we discussed a little bit on Thailand and uh, the options and possibilities they've had in this men's team. You can also discuss about Korea. They have left out Lee hyun world ranked number 27 in the men's singles, and Lee Dong-kyung, who's 42 on the world ranking. Lee hyun has not played for Korea for quite some years in the in the team event but uh, still a very very strong play on on the world circuits and and I think he got to the uh, quarter final of the all England this year so um Korea also have some options to play a different team but they have chosen to play this young team who once again is coming through against a very difficult opponent like Thailand today Good commitment there by Ha. Not able to control the length of the shot. Service over. Body smash here by Ha. 15, 16. And 16, 
give oh. him that much time to hit it. He can hit really strong smashes. And this was no exception. He simply had too much time on his hand, could place it anywhere he wanted it. Service over. 17, 16. Once again, we had a very fine example of closing down the net by Chong Nuam. It was not needed, but it was important that he was taking that step forward 19, in the previous 16. rally. And here, suddenly, 16 all, and then 1916 for Thailand. attack good cross-court attack here 20, setting up points, four game 16. points and first time of asking Playing that beautiful First tumbling net Thailand. drop. And Tungnam is winning the first game, 21 16. Just 17 minutes. I'll try to have a look at this one. Perfect. Really well played. Taking the right chance at the right time. See how it's spinning and then clip the top of the table at the same time. And there's nothing his opponent from Korea, Ha Young Wung, can do. Second game, level play. Oh. Yeah, good play once again, that cross court smash. One love. I Tung Nguyen. I think it's really nice to see these two players fighting it out. I know the tie has been uh, decided it's already 3-1 for Korea. Two However, I love. can see a lot of pride is put into this match. Nobody wants to lose. They give it the best they have and uh, play good quality men's singles, especially considering that this men's singles number three in a team. Three, love. Four, 
Islam. Yeah, that's going wide. Good pressure by her. Service over. Getting One, on the scoreboard, four. very important. Have to stay with his opponent so he doesn't run away. As he cannot afford that, having lost the first game. Four. Two, four. Beautiful slow motion pictures. Using his height very well here. Three, four. Ah, Young Wong, look at that. Cross court reverse drop shot, play to perfection. Entirely sure what this, this is, but it looks maybe as a blood injury. And that obviously have to be stopped. Let's see if we can detect anything from this. Sure, if that's a blood injury, maybe it's because the racket hit his his foot or his leg in one of the shots. It happens sometimes. And we're ready to resume four all. Play. Going long. Well left by Tung Lam. Service over. Six, five. 
Oh, what a miss. That's where you have to focus. That's where you have to concentrate. You Six. earned it. Oh. And you cannot afford to miss things like that. 7-5 would have been so much more appealing. But somehow, I feel a lot of players are taking these big opportunities just for granted. I'm just going to put it away. It's no problem. And you see it so often that they miss it. Lost the step there. Yeah. Not really easy to recover. Service over. Seven, six. <laughs> yeah, good defensive shot. Really Service well played over. by Ha Yung Wong. Seven. Oh. This is good badminton. That's nice. That's really well played by Ha. Excellent shot. Eight, seven. Going out, it's wide. Challenge. We have a challenge. challenge. So let's see what call Hawkeye is out. saying. Let's call out. Yeah, that's way out. Challenge unsuccessful. One challenge remaining. Service over. Eight all. Play. Yeah, good play. Nine eight. He's putting himself into trouble here. This one here, he's got to cover straight down the line. He's got to co cover the cross-court smash as well. And then very well chosen by uh, Jung Nguyen to go that cross-court drop shot. So uh, too many shots to cover. Court's too big. Put yourself Service into trouble. Got to watch out for that uh, oh. cross-court from the forehand into the deep forehand because he's crossing right over the...
Stein. Hot. Oh. That's well played. It was very well played by Ha. Let's see if we can see anything in this replay. Yeah, that's a fault. It was never over. You're not allowed to hit the shot on the other side of the net. It have to pass the net before you can hit it. And he was definitely hitting that shot on the wrong side of the net for him. And the umpire was very right. Tongnam challenges called in. And it is in. Challenge unsuccessful. One challenge remaining. So 11 10 interval. Interval. And high and warm into the interval. 11 10. Good day. Eleven ten play. Yeah, not easy to defend when it deflects from oh. the top of the tape as it did here. Virtually impossible for her to know where it's coming. And adjust his shot. play it's still a very nice lift by her and this is short yes this is very short Service over. easy to put away for the tall man
over. 14, 13. It's a little bit interesting here with Hart because he's a tall player, 188. And normally tall players find it difficult to defend on the body as what we just saw here. But I feel when I've been watching him here today, many attacks have been launched at, at his body and he has defended it so well. Which is quite unusual for, for really tall players. It's going wide. Service over. 14 all. to go down the line on most of his smashes. I'm not saying it's a bad idea. It works really well. But sometimes, again, looking for the variation. Service over. 15 all. is taking a little bit too many chances gotta keep it solid make sure he doesn't make these mistakes service over 16 all and opportunities like this will arise Again, that spinning net shot at the top of the tape, 16. forcing the short lift. So, seventeen, sixteen. away from winning this fifth and final match in the tie between Korea and Thailand. Good play, good play. Yeah, that's nice. Service over. 17-18. Trying to go across the centre of the court, very flat 19, lift. 17. And this time from the backhand side, this one here, and it's getting punished. You have to watch out for shots like that. If you want to cross that centre, you must give it some more height. But that's an awesome smash. Service over. 18, 19. Yeah, 
Hips by left, going out in the baseline. 19 all. So are we going to be treated to a third game here, or will Tung Nam be able to finish it in two? Chances are Service over. it might be in two. 20. Match point. Match 19. point has arrived. So 2019. That's an opportunity, and here it comes. 21 19. Thailand and this young player here, Panavit Tongwam, wins the Thailand. final match 21, of this 16, evening. 21 16, 21 19, in just 40 minutes. Here we have the results of the match between Korea and Thailand, where Korea won 3-2. It all started off in the first men's singles. Took 69 minutes on one hole, winning 19-21, 21-12, 21-16 against Avi Hing Sanong. Then it was followed by the first men's doubles and yet another three-game match where Jung and Kim is winning 21-18, 19-21, 21-17 against Isrianet and Namdash. Followed by the second men singles, Hyo Kwang Hee losing in two games, 19-21, 15-21 to Wang Churan of Thailand. Followed by the second men's doubles, Kang and Kim winning in two, uh, sorry, three games against Ketran and Puova Ranokro. And it was 18-21, 21-19, 21-17. It was a fantastic match between the four young players. And finally, the men's third singles in 40 minutes. We saw Panavit Tungram beating Ha Yung Wong, 21-16, 21-19. And that concludes the match of this evening. And... Uh, as you can see here, we had the court schedule on uh, court number one. Uh, France beat, quite surprisingly, India in the Thomas Cup for one this morning. And this afternoon, Thailand won the Uber Cup 5-0 against Germany, as expected. And as you can see, the match we just watched, Korea winning 3-2 against Thailand tonight. So I do hope that you have enjoyed this evening with us. Please do join us again tomorrow for more action from the Total BWF Thomas and Uber Cup finals here in Bangkok. From myself, Morton Frost and the rest of the crew, bye for now.